And from auto to aviation, now auto, we have come and here race to make electric and hybrid cars is bringing many companies together. In the latest, France's Renault and China's Geely, they say they would jointly develop petrol electric hybrid vehicles for China and South Korean markets as French automaker revives plans for world's biggest car market, China, after exiting Chinese venture last year. In China, where over 25 million vehicles were sold last year, Renault will use Geely's newly launched hybrid car system to jointly develop vehicles under Renault brand. Automakers are keen to use petrol-electric hybrid vehicles, which have better fuel efficiency than all petrol counterparts, to meet increasingly tougher auto regulations around the world. These hybrid vehicles, which drivers cannot charge with electricity directly, are different from plug-in hybrid cars. China has some of the world's strictest rules regarding production of greenhouse gas emitting vehicles as it battles unhealthy levels of air pollution in crowded cities. Japanese automakers Toyota and Honda they have long been developing and making hybrid cars. But Chinese automakers, including Geely, owner of Volvo cars, it has a 7.9% stake in Daimler as well and Great Wall. They both are following and rolling out hybrid car technologies in the past one year. Last year, Geely and Daimler said China could emerge as a manufacturing and export hub for hybrid power trains, jointly developed for Volvo and Mercedes-Benz car. Weon now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.